Welcome everybody. Let me draw the diagram of the equilateral triangle. This is an equilateral triangle. We expect it to find its height. So let me write that down. Equilateral triangle. And we are given the following, the shape of the interior parts of the triangle is given in this fashion. It looks very confusing. And this is 90, this is 90, and this is 90. This distance is 3 units. This distance is 2 units. This distance is 5 units. And we are expected to find the height of the triangle. Now, what I'm going to do is foremost, I'm going to name the triangle A, B, C. After naming the triangle, I would like to actually complete the parts of the triangle. So let me actually complete it in this fashion. So I'm going to connect this vertex to this vertex so that I have a triangle inside. Then what I will do, I will also connect this vertex so I can see that I have three triangles inside. Now what I wish to do is I would like to name this vertex as D. Right, so if I were to be asked the area of triangle ABC, this entire triangle, then I can state that this area is nothing but area of ADC plus area of ADB. So when I say ADB, I'm talking about the triangle, right? There is a triangle here. Plus the area of BDC, triangle BDC, right? So this is actually obtained from seeing the figure. Now what I wish to do is I would like to, since it's an equilateral triangle, let me state that since it is given, it is given the triangle is an equilateral triangle, right? So this would imply all sides are equal, all sides are equal. So let the length of the sides be all equal to say A units. Now this is going to be A units, this is going to be A units, this is going to be A units. Now what I wish to do is I would like to take this part as say H1 this height is h1, this height is h2, and this height is h3. Now we know that the area of a triangle is given as half into base times height, right? So using this formula, this means 
the area of triangle A D C A D C is equal to half into the base is A units the height is H1 also the area of triangle ADB ADB is half into base into height I'm writing the next one over here and area of BDC triangle BDC half into base into height now if H be the height of triangle A B C then the area of triangle A B C will be half into the base into height H be the height so if I were to take this as 1 therefore 1 can be rewritten as half into A into H is equal to place this place this place this with the addition operator so 1 over 2 A times H1 plus 1 over 2 A times H2 plus 1 over 2 A times H3 now take 1 over 2 and A out you get H1 plus H2 plus H3 on the left you got 1 over 2 A times H now 1 over 2 can be cancelled on both sides A can be cancelled on both sides so therefore what do you got therefore height H is equal to H1 plus H2 plus H3 so this means the height of triangle ABC is equal to what's this 3 plus 2 plus 5 3 plus 2 plus 5 3 plus 2 5 5 plus 5 will give me 10 units so that's the answer it's a beautiful question and we have also seen the proof this is actually a literal proof how exactly we have obtained the height of this equilateral triangle. So having mentioned that, we'll move on to the next question.